Hello, Ed here on Friday the 22nd, a Bitcoin update. Uh, on the higher time frame, this is the daily, not much change. Uh, we had that downtrend. Here a consolidation, what looks like a bearish flag. We are at the, are at the bottom. I showed you uh, in a couple of videos reasoning why I think we might have that move to the upside. Uh, and, and we did have a pretty strong pullback yesterday, but we did have that before. So I'm hoping it is like that. Um, but on the lower time frame, uh, things didn't really go like I was expecting and let me explain why um, this is the four hour two supply zones two days in a row we hit those zones and see a strong reaction from there um, while well, i was expecting a move towards that box <clears throat> let me show you on the one hour what happened yesterday uh, when i was doing my video we were here and I was saying I want to see this move, take out these lows and then make the move to that red box. But the dollar was uh, going, coming down pretty strong at that moment and I said we need the dollar to bounce and uh, go a bit higher again and then we can make this move and then later on going up. It didn't happen. Uh, Bitcoin broke out here i showed you also this level i said look for a breakout here uh, which happened and continued higher and you can see here breakout retest and going higher at that moment i was full in belief that we were going higher and that we wouldn't make this move anymore so one two three four five a bit of a correction and then continuation to the upside Nope, didn't happen, but look where we are, exactly at that green box. Taking out these lows, and uh, now it's, um, for me, a waiting time to see what happens. We are at my key level, 40,000, uh, below actually, 40,600, but what's going to happen here? We did have uh, a bunch of... Uh, longs liquidated on the way down so it's always to expect then uh, a reaction for now I want to see strength coming back such a retest and then I would slowly start belief in an up move again because this is still uh, bothering me uh, that we ended there for the downside I want to see a break below this level and then some sort of bearish flag and then short it to the downside. Um, that's more or less what I do. Sideline for this or this. Uh, my Elliott wave chart is uh, not saying a lot. There is plenty of opportunities here. Uh, I straight down from here. We do get that bounce and then down because we have that downtrend or we do a very surprising fifth leg and uh, then way higher but that could take weeks months before we get there that's it what i wanted to show you for me sidelines and maybe that's also very nice to go into the weekend and i wish you also a very nice weekend i'm uh, close to uh, four minutes and that means i want to stop thank you for watching and have a nice weekend all